Usually when LEGO releases a set, there's two different versions of the box. You have one for North America, well, I mean, it's also used in like South America, where you'll have the piece count, the set name, though there are some instances of the non-piece count boxes having the set names, especially with licensed themes and stuff. Um, and then for the ones that are released in the rest of the world, you don't get the set names usually, and you're missing the piece count. Well, LEGO is doing something with Animal Crossing that I've never seen them do before that's actually kind of cool. It's not like a decision that will make this something that you should buy, but still I find it fascinating. And that's in Japan, they're making exclusive boxes for LEGO Animal Crossing. Specifically, it'll have the Japanese logo and some Japanese text on it. I've never seen them do this with any other theme. Stuff like even LEGO Super Mario, which is a Japanese property, didn't use a Japanese logo. But then again, Super Mario in general doesn't use Japanese text, even in the releases in Japan. So that's not surprising. Honestly, part of me low-key kind of wants all the Japanese boxes. That Japanese logo just looks so freaking cool. Can you blame me? Anyways, let me know what you think of this small but cool detail for the LEGO Animal Crossing Japanese boxes. Subscribe here for more fun LEGO videos and news, and I'll see you later. Peace out.